Welcome back to day two of the Willoughby Adventures, Blue Water Edition. So this one was an absolute pisser. We had an absolute ball and we got some brilliant fish on the boat. So uh, it's pretty much a repeat of day one of the Blue Water series. And uh, we really did nothing different, except we just lined a couple of things out. We kind of found a few things out that worked the day before or didn't work the day before. And we just ran with it. And a lot of quality fish in the deck. So it uh, should be a good episode. And I'll see you out there. Cheers. Alex has actually hooked up some decent here. Oh, I reckon Trev. He's got head kicks like Trev, tail kicks. That was on literally. Ooh, potential Dewey, man. Left over a piece of squid. Potential Dewey. Because I'm. I mean, code is sounding great. Nah. Oh. What do you call them, mate? Fish? Fish. Fair. As long as he stays. As long as he stays. I think he will. I don't know the travel fucking do, man. Just with that. Doop, doop, doop. Try and get him away from the coda, though. Let's keep going that way. I reckon. I don't know. I'm going to stop trying to call it. <laughs> It's big. <laughs> that looks like shark. It's a, that's a Trev. Whoa. That's an actual GT, I think. I think that's a actual GT. Dude. Um, wild. Willoughby at sunrise GTs. Come that way, mate. Yeah. I don't have bogus or anything. I don't even know how we're going to get him in the boat because I don't want to gaff him. Could probably gaff him through the lip, though. You know what I mean? That's an actual GT. None of that brassy shit. Yeah. <laughs> that was on. That. Stupid Scary. bit, yeah. Scary. All right, he's. I'll try and get him through the fucking mouth. Come on, buddy. Oh, man. You're right, man. I don't. He's not. I'd rather try and look after him than. That's stupid heavy. Come in. Yes. <laughs> Come on. That's my first GT, buddy ripper. I've never even seen one in the flesh, and they are actually ridiculous. He's heavy. Yeah. Oh. All right, bud. Yep. Oh, oh. he'll be that right. Good. Yes. <laughs> uh, Woo! Oh. How's that? Big school of these dudes. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Come on, man. I'm trying to. Bus! That's number like eight in five <laughs> minutes. <laughs> Oh. 
How long is it gonna take me? Oh, shit. Are you fucking this Yeah. snappers well snappy snap snap yep oh. nah we got shit loads of leader I got I got 80 what like tough 80 Yes. Yes, better. Oh, trouty! Oh, trout! Get the cuff! We can right have a net! Oh, bro. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, what I meant to say is it's not a stripey, god damn it! <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Catching different shit! <laughs> There you go. That's what did the damage. A tailless four inch a paddle tail in nuke chicken. With no tail. Yeah, tailless. That's been missing for the last three or four stripes. Boop, boop. How cool is that, eh? Sunrise trouties. That's wild. Not a bad spot. Anyway, this big boy's going straight in the coffin. The chompers. Yup. <laughs> There's still an absolute show on the sounder. Yeah. Oh. There's a good lobby. Yeah, shoot, yeah. You reckon? Okay. You can just chill, bang. ruined it. Oh, I got no battery either. Dude. This piss poor. <laughs> yeah, 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 you're gonna need to... I'll try a turn, but I think you're gonna need to... I'm coming under. Yeah. Do hands. Yeah, I know, I said do hands. So, my little stripe is just been eaten. That's gotta be G, man. You got some battery on? Can you get it out, little orange tub on the left? And uh, I'll tell you what, this is, this is hard work. Yeah. Oh, you still got time? I still got a little bit, yep. Yeah. Tuna right there, maybe. <laughs> oh! Oh, 
Oh, he's right. I think a shark's on him, man. Something's on that. What was that on you, Livey? I don't know. That was just a big blow. I thought it might have been him coming up. Ah! I'm stinging, eh? It's big, Jay. Yeah. Huge, Jay. You're the gaff ready, man. Um, yeah. Oh, on the treb car. Yeah. Just in the mouth if you can, man. I had to hold the weight the last time and do it. You're all right, mate. I'd rather we look after him than shit gaff and he dies, you know what I mean? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so I threw down a live stripey. Uh, <laughs> Want to take your little uh, 80 pound rig and I cannot believe that we actually landed that fish just small trebles in the fin there and this is probably it's a little bit smaller than Alex's I reckon it might be about seven or six kilo but these things are an absolute tank anyway we're gonna get a couple of picks this is my first ever GT and then uh, we're gonna spear him back all right this fella's going home Say hi to big boy. Woo! He trims over here and eats that one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That oh. oh, was wild. He'll be alright. Yeah, he'll be alright. Where is the gaff in case it is a little Spanish? At the front. Pump and wine. Pump and wine, baby. Pump and wine. He gave it a good little smack. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh, swing. Oh! That. It's either it, oh, it looks cooterish. Oh. <laughs> the gas. No, I think that's a. Oh, I'm not going to say it, man. I'm going to say it. Okay. Yeah, come up. It's either a stonking cuda or that's a Spanish. That's a Spanish. You're gonna have to come back down here, man. He's gonna he's gonna come down. That's a good Spanish. I'll just you just move around me. You're all right, bros. Yeah, it's all right. It's out. It's out of the water. Take your motor off. It won't matter, man. It's in neutral. Might even be easier if I just tail him, eh? Instead of fucking around with the gaff, yeah, bro. Yeah, fuck, fuck the gaff. That's an... Oh. We got one. Fucking got one. <laughs> well, this is what we wanted. Watch your braid and shit, dude. Yeah, yeah. Get away. He's a pisser, man. I like how it's like, mm, looks cooterish. Wrong. Looks Spanish. Yeah. 
Yeah, you're all mate. You're all. You're all. Running, running circles, mate. You're all right. Need to keep tight though. It's just about dusted, I think. You can turn his head here. If you can turn his head here. There's another one with him. Oh, I don't care about that one. Turn his. If. Bro, he's he's actually like pretty decent, eh? Yep, yep. Turn his head. Turn his head. Nah, just. That's all right. That's all right, man. Oh my god! Holy donkey! Where? No trace. Thank you. Oh my fucking shit! That's like. Oh, dude. That's crazy. That's what that is. Oh. Oh, hey, no, I'm taking I'm the shaking. I'm shaking, I can't even hold still. Words? Heavy. <laughs> Heavy. Oh my god. He's going down. Yeah, do it. Alright. Oh. Let's bleed him and, and oh. get him in the coffin, mate. That is. Oh, the jealousy is. Yeah, it's real. Yeah. Been trying to get one of those cunts for years. First one. Well, <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. This is uh oh, there's no point even measuring him because he's not gonna he's gonna be bigger than my esky. I reckon, he, I reckon he's about ten kilo, what do you think? I reckon he's he's heavy. Yeah. Shitting oath off, yeah. Any stupidly big queen. <laughs> <laughs> the biggest queen to ever have queened. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You are not what I wanted, mate. You know what? I'm going to be like this. He got hit by a shark. See his top? Oh, I almost let go of that. Wow, well, he inhaled that. Mm. He's got a remora on him. See a little remora on his sword? Yeah, right. Just tail him. Most cop travels hang time. <laughs> that's oh, the remora. Yeah. Well, not a bad skinny bit of uh, Spanish boy catch. It's not my PB, but he wouldn't be too far off it. Anyway, what's up? There he goes. Whoo! Yep. Yep. 
missed it. <laughs> so at the moment, we've just um, come off the boat and I've just left it on spot off there. No one's in it, so it's probably a little bit dodgy, but she'll be right. And we're just looking for really big oysters. <laughs> Actually just found one while I've uh, been doing this. Uh, wow, yeah, that's a, that's a perler. So this right here is exactly why we're walking the shoreline. And from here I can see one, two, three, four really good oysters just here. This is absolutely crazy. Like, look at the depth on this oyster. So we're going to take a bunch of these back to camp and um, probably do like some Kilpatrick style uh, oyster cooking, I think, is the plan at the moment. But yeah, we just got a bit bored of fishing. I was popping these flats here and had a couple of hits and had some queenies and stuff come up and say g'day, but thought we'd just explore this like really cool looking island. And we heard there were a few oysters about, and I'll tell you what, it's pretty wild, the size of these ones up here. So we're just gonna gather up a few more of these, and I think this afternoon uh, we'll do a bit of a cook up. But um, anyway, we'll get a couple more in the esky and then uh, go do some more fishing, I think. It doesn't look like I'm gonna have to work very hard to get a big feed of oyster anyway. <sighs> so we just found this rock, we just, um, beat the back of the shell off that's the back of the oyster have a look at the meat on that <laughs> that is wild yep this is craziness this is like almost the size of my palm it looks like a bloody it looks like an abalone absolutely stupid <laughs> I think it's good brass. I think he did it, yeah. he did it. There you go. Pull him back around. It's not even that good actually, he's just... Nah, he's not, he's not... Oh, oh, oh! That's all good knots. Alex just dropped what we're pretty sure is a nice dewy and um, and I chucked a little nuclear chicken jerk bait down and this fella inhaled it. He's going home. Belly flop. Belly flop. <laughs> we can probably get him up. Another goldie I think. Bad oh, Trev. That's all right. That's all right. On the drop, mate. On the drop. Yep. First crank. Yeah, yeah. Go, get down there, dude. Whatever this is, it's good. Oh, it's just a cod, man. Good cod, probably about high 40s. Still got my snapper, just chill banging. So that's it for Blue Water Day 2. How's that? Alex seems to always outdo me on the water. Got a dollar 25 Spanish. The GT was bigger. As you saw on the previous episode, his Tusky was bigger. Just always seems to outdo me on the Blue Water side of the house. So, uh, it is what it is, it's going to be a common occurrence throughout the Blue Water series. But uh, yeah, pretty crazy fishing, two GTs and a really nice Spaniard. Definitely can't complain with that. As always, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for tuning in. Yoo.